that race and and continue through. Exciting race for, for Heat 1 and Heat 2 now stepping onto the track. We've got Austin Dahlquist of Roots running, Garrett O'Toole running unattached, Lopez Suarez from Neftali, Garrett McQuitty running unattached, Kenneth Talavera of UTEP, Gedrius Valencius of CBU, Mason Ratkovich of Claremont Mud Scripps, Morgan Le Guen of BAC Elite, and Yoan Koal running unattached. I think they took a little bit of notice of the first heat and said we're not going to let it get out <laughs> too slow. At least they go out under 29 seconds for the first 200, mm -hmm. which is about where you want to be. Yep, but that's what I love so much about this 1500, the different strategies that people approach this race for from. You know, like Van E. Kirk, he said, if, if they'll go slower with me and stay behind me, I absolutely enjoy leading that pace. But then, you know, points are understood, and Bizimana knew we have to push that pace. Now here, you have the experience of seeing that, you know what, let me remind myself, if I let others control it, they will. And so let me get out here and kind of control it. Well, they've eased up a little bit off the gas. Uh, we'll see. This is Austin Dahlquist. And leading the charge right now. Uh, we did see a rabbit on in the women's 1500 Invitational. The Dahlquist out well on that right at like 60 second pace. And, and that's kind of what you'd expect for uh, a race like this. They get out around that pace, try and stay about as even as possible. A little bit of a burn up late in the race. Dahlquist, Talavera, McQuitty, and Valencius. Your top four right now. And it stayed that way for the last 400 meters. Starting to mix it up now is Mason Ratkovich in the maroon and yellow top. Sixty-two second lap for Dahlquist. He realizes it and puts a little surge on. Garrett McQuitty goes with him. Garrett O'Toole running an attach, but in the yellow kit on the outside. Starting to make a move. Dahlquist and McQuitty, though, breaking away from the pack. And Garrett O'Toole going to have to do some work now to reel him in. They'll go through 1,000 meters right around 230, so... That little drop in pace, they've picked it back up now. O'Toole trying to be the one to bridge the gap. Talavera with him. Dahlquist, McQuitty, Morgan Le Guin, and Garrett O'Toole, your top four. And they've got 300 meters to go. Le Guin looks like he's really trying to make a move and go to this inside, move himself right into second place. But I don't think McQuitty's going to try and give that up. He's worked way too hard for that this whole time. McQuitty makes a wise move, goes back down to yep. the middle of lane one for the turn, and now he'll start swinging back to the outside of Dahlquist. Dahlquist and McQuitty. Le Guin start to get dropped by the pack and here comes McQuitty on the outside Dahlquist been leading the whole way he's got something left in the tank McQuitty pressing by on the outside it's going to be Garrett McQuitty now by how much McQuitty to the line 342 50 closes it down in a 55 second last lap and a valiant effort by Austin Dahlquist to fight back down the home stretch just McQuitty, who was able to stay in second, third place that entire time, didn't have to do any work, saved it for one move with 150 to go, and it's really tough to hold that off when you're Dahlquist and you've been pressing the gas a little right. bit the entire race. And that's what I was going to say. So you always find yourself wondering, that person is kind of riding the front runner, McQuitty, riding the front runner. You're like, how much does he really have? Is he in this position because he actually will have a kick at the end? Or is he holding? He's just like, once, you know, Dahlquist goes, I'm just going to be in second place. But McQuitty clearly knew he had a quicker turnover. And he said, if I keep him close, I don't want to leave it too far. Keep him close and I can go away with the win. McQuitty does come away with the win. 342.50. Austin Dahlquist, Roots Running Project, finishes second. 